hello everyone welcome back to mass explorer in this video i'm going to solve and find the value of this beautiful simplification math problem which is 2 raised to power 15 plus 2 raised to power 12 plus 2 raised to power 9 plus 2 raised to power 6 plus 2 raised to power 3 so here we will try to solve this problem without using a calculator what we'll do here here first of all we will try to factorize the powers so for that we can write these powers as 2 raised to power 15 can be written as 3 times 5 which is 15 plus 2 raised to power 12 can be written as 3 times 4 which is 12 plus 9 can be written as 3 times 3 which is 9 plus 2 raised to power 6 6 can be written as 2 times 3 or 3 times 2 plus in this power 2 raised to power 3 this will be the same 2 raised to power 3 now here in these four terms we will use an exponential identity so here we will use this one exponential identity in these first four terms a raised to power m times n which can also be written as a raised to power m whole raised to power n now using this exponential identity we can write this number this equation as this will become 2 raised to power 3 whole raised to power 5 plus this will become 2 raised to power 3 whole raised to power 4 plus 2 raised to power 3 whole raised to power sorry this is not 9 this is 3 3 plus 2 raised to power 3 whole raised to power 2 plus 2 raised to power 3 here we will try to find out the value of 2 raised to power 3 which is based in all the terms so therefore we can write 2 raised to power 3 is it means we have to multiply 2 3 times so 2 times 2 is 4 and 4 times 2 is 8 so the value of 2 cube or 2 raised to power 3 is 8 so here we will replace all the bases with 8 so this number will become is equal this will become at raised to power 5 plus at raised to power 4 plus at raised to power 3 plus at raised to power 2 plus and here simply 8 or at raised to power 1 now what will be our next step in next step we will try to make these two numbers the same power same and these two numbers have a same power so for that we will do some changes in the power of this number and this number so therefore we can write this power 8 this power 5 is 4 plus 1 plus at raised to power 4 plus we will do some changes in this power so we can write this 3 is 2 plus 1 plus at raised to power 2 plus at raised to power which is simply 8 now here in these two numbers in these two terms we will use another exponential identity so here we will use this one exponential identity in these two terms a raised to power m plus n which can also be written as a raised to power m times a raised to power n now using this identity we can write these two numbers as this will become a raised to power 4 times at raised to power 1 plus this will be the same at raised to power 4 plus this can be written as at square times at raised to power 1 plus at square plus at now look at two these two terms in these two terms at raised to power 4 is common and in these two terms at raised to power 2 is common so we will take out at raised to power 4 common from these two terms and at raised to power 2 from these two terms so this equation will become taking at raised to power 4 common so here at raised to power 1 is left which is simply 8 plus here only 1 is left plus and just take at raised to power 2 common from these two terms so here again simply 8 is left plus here 1 is left plus this one 8 now what is 8 plus 1? 8 plus 1 is simply 9. So this will become at raised to power 4 times 9 plus 
this will become eight raised to power two times nine plus this one eight. Now here in these two terms nine is common, so we will take out nine common from the first two terms. So this will become here eight raised to power four is left plus here eight square is left plus this one eight. Now next we can write this number is eight raised to power four is nine times. We can write this as eight raised to power two times eight raised to power two plus eight raised to power two plus eight. Here we will take eight square or eight raised to power two common from these two terms inside the parentheses. So this will become nine times taking eight raised to power two common. So here eight raised to power two is left plus here only one is left plus a what is the value of a square a square is simply 64 this is because multiplying a two times a time a is 64 so here we will replace these two numbers with 64 so this number will become 9 times this is 64 times and this is 64 plus 1 plus 8 and we will simplify these numbers so this will become 9 times this is 64 times and this is 65 plus 8 and we will try to multiply these two numbers without using a calculator and without standard multiplication so let's learn how can you multiply these numbers without using a calculator so nine times here we can write the 64 as the sum of 60 plus 4 and we can write this 65 as the sum of 60 plus 5 plus 8 and here we can easily multiply these numbers with each other so here first we multiply this 60 with 60 and then with 5 and then multiply 4 with these two numbers first with 60 and then with 5 so let's multiply these numbers so this will become <laughs> 9 times here 60 times 60 is simply 60 square plus 60 times 5 is this will be 60 times 5 plus we multiply 4 with these two numbers so 4 times 60 plus 4 times 5 is simply 20 plus 8 and let's further simplify these numbers so this will become 9 times what is 60 square 60 square is simply 3600 plus 5 times 0 is 0 and 5 times 6 is 30 so this is 300 plus 4 times 0 is 0 and 4 times 6 is 24 so this is 240 plus 20 plus add now let's further add these four numbers so this will become nine times so now to add these four numbers we will start from the ones position zero plus zero plus zero plus zero is zero now two plus four is six six plus zero plus zero is six now two plus three is five five plus six is eleven so one number will be carried to the next digit next is three three plus one is four so here the addition of these four numbers gives him 4160 plus a now we have to multiply these two numbers and then finally we will add the result with a so we will do this multiplication here the multiplication is 9 times 4160 plus a so we have to multiply these two numbers now to multiply these two numbers again we will start from the ones position so here 9 times 0 is 0 this will become 0 9 times 6 is 54 so 4 5 will be carried 9 times 1 is 9 9 plus 5 is 14 so this will become 4 1 will be carried to the next digit no 9 times 4 is 36 36 plus 1 is 37 so this gives him 37,440 plus 8 here we will add this 8 to the ones digit that is 0 so 8 plus 0 is 8 this gives him 37,448 so finally 37,448
is our answer and value of this beautiful and interesting math problem now in last if you like this video so don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel for such a more interesting and step-by-step -step math videos thanks for watching